One, two, one, two. Hey, let's play and welcome to the final part of Day of Reckoning. It's been a pretty quick journey. I thought this game would be a bit longer, but uh, I can't complain. I've had fun playing it. So uh, before we get into our WrestleMania Iron Man match against The Undertaker, might as well uh, use our final uh, attribute points and uh, boost up something here. Probably going to do Charisma because I want to build up a finisher really quick. Speed would probably be another good thing, but it really hasn't come in handy. As it doesn't really seem anyway, so do Charisma to 9, and then we'll boost speed up to whatever we can here. 3.5, ooh. Okay, we'll do Charisma to 8.5 then, and speed up to 4.5. That's how we'll uh, finish off this game. So let's uh, get into our final match, Iron Man match, WrestleMania, Undertaker. Let's do it. Third week of March, show 32, WrestleMania 20. I are excite. Oh shit, it's Vinnie Mac. What's up, dog? Well, here we are, WrestleMania, the granddaddy of them all. You know, when you first signed your contract earlier this year, I had a hunch that you'd be a blue chipper with a bright future. But even I, Vincent Kenny McMahon, could never have guessed that you'd have such a meoric rise to the organization. Not even I could have guessed that you'd reach an almost unpresented level of success quickly. But you have, and you've met every challenge along the way. So tonight, on the evening of your first WrestleMania, you have my sincere congratulations. Thanks a lot, Vince. That's Mr. McMahon to you. Right, Mr. McMahon. Oh, and one last word of advice. You have an opportunity tonight, a very special opportunity, to win one of the greatest trophies in our business, the WWE Championship. I don't have to remind you that there is a locker room full of superstars in the back, each of uh, which have yeah, each of which have worked their entire career to earn that chance you have tonight. So my advice to you, win or lose, make the most of this shot while you've got it. You're up against one of the greatest superstars of all time, The Undertaker. He is going to do everything in his power to destroy you in order to defend his title. Go out there and give it everything you've got. Because I guarantee you, uh, guarantee you that it will screw, if you screw it up, you'll you'll get no chance in hell of getting another chance like this anytime soon. You can count on me, Mr. McMahon. I've worked hard to get to this point, and I'm not going to let anybody. I'm not going to let anybody down, especially myself and Undertaker. He might be undefeated at WrestleMania, but tonight I'm going to make history when I take his belt and his streak once and for all. Damn right, son. Alright, here he comes. The number one contender. The United States Champion. The Tag Team Champion. <laughs> Mr. Old School Samuel Wrestling. And as we all know, Mr. Old School, the man, this WrestleMania 20 set looks shitty. <laughs> as we all know, uh, Samuel Wrestling been um, worked his way up into the business for Sunday Night Heat, joined the new ministry, and then got screwed over by them. Because Undertaker fears the young up-and-comer from taking his title. But he's fought through everything, tooth and nail, to get to this point. The main event at WrestleMania for the WWE Undisputed Championship. Now all he needs to do is beat the Undertaker. And here he comes, the demon of Death Valley, the man who has never lost a match at WrestleMania, The Undertaker. Looking uh, devious as shit, as per usual, WWE Champion, Undertaker. Never seen his entrance, so I'm, you know, just gonna enjoy it right now. His very ominous entrance. Hopefully, maybe I should continue talking, because, you know, if I'm not talking, then you can hear the music, and then WWE crams the lawsuit on my ass. Not a lawsuit, but copyright, because they're a bunch of dick riders. But here he is, The Undertaker, the man who's never lost to WrestleMania, and he's looking to continue that streak and continue holding on to that WWE Undisputed Championship. Is Mr. Aston the one that can stop him? My bet is no. All right, 15 minute Iron Man match. That's not too bad. It's usually around the length of a, of a normal video for the this series. Iron Man match, not too bad either, because, oh God, power bomb. Because if Undertaker beats me once, which he probably is going, definitely gonna do, but uh, you know, I'll be able to keep the damage up on him and you know, eventually be able to beat him and hopefully get more wins than he does. For those of you who don't know what an Iron Man match is, 15 minutes.
probably edit that out, <laughs> if I remember. Person with the most uh, pinfalls or submission wins. You can also hit someone with a chair, but that would uh, give you uh, a loss. But also, in real life, it would give you an advantage. If I do recall correctly, I believe uh, it might have been Randy Orton that did that against John Cena in one of their Iron Man matches that they had. I think it was at SummerSlam, if I recall correctly. Pretty sure, pretty sure Randy Orton hits uh, Cena with a steel chair early on in the match. Gave Cena the 1-0 lead and then hit him like an RKO or something right after and took the 2-1 lead. If I recall correctly, it could have been somebody else, but sounds familiar to me. A big headbutt gets him in the corner. Oh, I tried to go for the flying forearm, but did not connect. There's a reversal though, he's going to throw him into the corner. Now he's going to hit the flying forearm. Boom! Clock under taking the back of the head. Falls up with a neck breaker. And as you can see, our momentum bar is going up much quicker than it usually does. Because of that upgrade we did. Go for the splash. Boom, he misses it again. Undertaker does not want to be splashed by my big body. Boom, the pile of driver. Dropping Undertaker right on his head. Follow that with an elbow drop. And the neck crank. Ugh, break his neck. And Undertaker goes down to the neck crank. He gets picked up one more time. Another neck crank. And breaks it again. One more time, why not? We can hit three. And the third neck crank. Oh, Undertaker's dead. He's down and out. The first pinfall could go Mr. Wrestling's one, way. Two, two three. three, there it is. Samuel Wrestling one, Undertaker zero. Oh, I tried to go for the big uh, clothesline, not clothesline, whatever the move that was. Wasn't paying attention. Flying form. Oh, tried to go for the back breaker, but it gets reversed into the Russian Lake Sweep. Wrestling trying to get back to his feet now. Reverses Taker. Going for the strong grapple. What's he looking for? Taker with the reversal. Reverses the reverse suplex into a suplex of his own. Boom. Taker has two finishers now. He'll be looking to do one of those shortly, I guarantee that. Mr. Aston with another finisher though. Going for the strong grapple. What's he looking for? Oh, he's got the iron claw. It's locked in deep. Break. But there's a rope break. Punch him in the dick. Alright, here we go. Oh, punch him in the dick, then kick him in the dick. Ooh, the combinations. They are dirty. Alright. Really wish I knew how to steal people's finishers. Neck crank again. Trying to kill Undertaker in this match. Undertaker already back to his feet after the first neck crank. He's gonna hit with the tallywagger. Boom! Tallywagger takes Undertaker down to his feet. He's already back up. Oh, he's trying to go for another one, but Undertaker with the reversal. Gonna hit another big power bomb in the middle of the ring. Undertaker now with three finishers. That's pretty insane. Oh, the sleeper hold. It's locked in. The old school move. The oldest of the old school moves. The sleeper hold. It's gonna do some decent damage, too, on Undertaker. Oh, Undertaker with a grapple. It gets reversed. He's going to the ropes. He's coming back. The bear hug. Another old school move by Mr. Old School. Samuel wrestling. Just destroying the body of Undertaker. One, I guess, technically the torso is not a limb, but one body part at a time. Oh, the power bombs! Mr. Aslan showing off his crazy amounts of strength right now with a triple power bomb. Taker looks like he's seen better days. Can Sam the Wrestling finish him off though? Oh, he's got him in the double underhook. Trying to just destroy every body part of Undertaker in this match. Is Samuel wrestling. Undertaker in danger right now. He's already back to his feet though. Taker with reversal, the Russian leg sweep. Taker having trouble getting back to his feet. Wrestling back to his feet. Taker, momentum shift. He's got the choke slam. He's got him up in the air and down he goes. The big choke slam right there. Uh-oh, Taker, what's he looking for here? Oh, the big boot. Oh, but Master Rasslin with the scoop slam, taking Taker down. Picking him back up to all fours. And by all fours, I mean two feet. <laughs> Uh-oh, he's gonna look for that. Tombstone. No, oh, no, he's going behind. Oh, oh, he did a fucking ditzy doodle around me. Looks like uh, Undertaker's gonna get a pinfall here for sure. Big pile driver on Samuel Rasslin. Can Rasslin kick out of it? Two, 
Will he be able to kick out of it? No, tied match at 1-1. One, one. one apiece now. Down to the ground he goes. Oh, he's got him. He's got him in the Dragon Sleeper. This has got to be it. There's no way Undertaker can kick out of this, or get out of this, I should say. Apparently he can, though, even though he's in red. Riddle me this, Batman. Riddle me this. Punch to the corner now. Samuel Wrestling looking for something big here. He's going to go for the dick kick. Boom, he hits it. Oh, he catches him. Went to go for the neck crank. Undertaker reversed it somehow with his magical voodoo bullshit. And he's going for another pin. One, One two. two. No, a kick out by Samuel Wrestling. He's not going down by no fucking Russian leg sweep. Get out of here. Undertaker gets reversed. Undertaker's going to go to the top rope now. Samuel Wrestling is top rope. The Exploder suplex. Taker's feeling it. He's feeling hurt right now. Sound wrestling, looking for something big there, but take a for reversal. Another reversal by Undertaker. Two finisher reversals in a row, and then another tombstone pile driver. That's absolutely insane. How does he reverse two finishers in a row? And the big tombstone pile driver there by Undertaker. Sound wrestling saying, no mas. Oh no, not another one. This isn't good. And a third tombstone. No, I don't want to be KO'd. Get out of here. Bullshit KO. I was in red. How's that KO? Get out of here. Let's put him in another freaking chokehold here. We'll make him submit this time. Make Taker submit in the grandest stage of them all. Submit, you punk. How did he not submit from that? He was in the submission thing. Get out of here. No. No. Wow, another reversal by Undertaker. This is getting out of hand. Uh oh, well, some reason just want to go for his finisher. Oh, going behind, eh? Oh shit! There's the reversal, big reversal right there. Trying to go for the big boot, but he fails miserably. Stop reversing everything I throw at you! It's getting a little ridiculous. No sell. The scoop slam. Yeah, two could play at that game. Look at that. Yeah, neck crank. You get KO'd. How about that? There you go. Do some serious damage to you now. Another neck crank which gets reversed because Undertaker can apparently reverse every finisher I throw at him. Uh-oh. Taker, what's he looking for here? He's going for the pinfall. Break. It's a rope break, luckily enough. Get kicked in the dick. Oh my god, another reverse by Undertaker. Another reverse by Undertaker. This is getting out of hand. Oh, there we go. I'll punch him. Wow, the Hadouken fails miserably. Oh, the big boot by Taker. Fly ahead but misses again, oh my goodness. And it's another two stuff. <laughs> Fuck you, game. Fuck you. Undertaker, I don't understand. When he was in full health, he wasn't reversing shit, and now that he's like destroyed, he's reversing everything. Another reversal by Taker, oh my goodness. It's the reversal party. Ugh. Get up. There we go. Big reversal there. Another reversal by Undertaker. That's never gonna get old, is it? Punch in the dick. Out of my ring. There we go. That should give us some time to breathe here, at least. Get in my ring. No bullshit! There's <laughs> some serious bullshit right there, man. The big tombstone. Fourth tombstone of the match. Get out of here. I'm not in KO, so I don't understand how this is a KO, but whatever. Oh, he's punching him in the face. Get up. I wanna, I wanna. Yeah, momentum shift you. Poke in the eye. No, I didn't mean to do that, damn it. Neckbreaker by Undertaker. Get up. Get up. It was just a neckbreaker. They're all ridiculous. Undertaker up 3-1 right now. There's a reversal. There we go. Let's take him down. Alright, neck crank him. There we go. We gotta get some pins here. Oh, that one looked like pain, a bunch of pain there for Undertaker. One, two, three. There we go. Three, two. Pin him again. One, two. Oh, he kicks out. Taker showing some resiliency right there. 
fucking out of the second pinfall from the neck crank. There's no way he kicks out of this one, though. Dead. Broken neck. Gotta get over here. Make sure he doesn't get the rope break. One. Two. Wow, he kicked out of a finisher. Are you kidding me? One. Two. Oh my goodness, Taker's kicking out everything right now. And the reversal. He's looking for something big here. Oh, big forearm. What's he looking for? Nothing, because I reversed him. And by reverse, I just mean grab them <laughs> before he grabbed me. Oh, another one. Pile driver. This one's going to do some damage. Boom, right on the top of his head. Not the move you want to get put into. Oh, the big swing. Sound wrestling. Throw in or take her around like a rag doll. Oh, didn't mean to do that. I wanted to turn you around. Oh, he's going to go for the rocking chair. A classic maneuver. The rocking chair. Locked in nice and tight. Hopefully this does some damage. So Undertaker's not as strong as he is. Looks like it did. Put him in orange in the back. How do you reverse when I'm in fucking super strength? There we go. Dragon Sleeper. Break. Bullshit. Roll break out of here, ref. You don't know Jack. Big forearm. Another big forearm. Oh, the reversal. Taker having none of it. Oh, the choke toss. Trying to choke him out of the ring. Undertaker now looking for the finisher. He's looking for the finisher. He's going to grapple crazy. Oh, the big military press slam. Mm. Taking him down. Undertaker already back to his feet somehow. Didn't mean to go to the top rope. Holy shit! Oh. Don't know what happened there, but it looked cool. Uh uh. Get out of here. This is my house. No, you're looking at the wrong guy there. Oh, bullshit. Okay, good. I thought he hit me with his finisher. I would have been mad. Uh oh. Oh, he's rubbing that forearm across my forehead. That ain't comfy. I'll tell you that much. Oh, God. Get up. Come on. There's two minutes left. I need another pin. Oh, bullshit. Get out here. I'm gonna get beat by a fucking elbow drop? Are you kidding me? Okay, good. How? 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 <laughs> I don't understand how he reverses a simple punch. It doesn't make any sense. Well, not kicking out of this one. That's for sure. That's a special? Okay. One, two, three. Yeah, I didn't think so. 4-2 for Undertaker. No, none of that. Up you go, and down you go. Already back to his feet somehow. Magic man. Up you go, and down you go. Get him. The yeah, there you go. Dragon sleeper. Come on, make him submit. Make him submit. Make him submit. Come on, submit. There you go. That's what I'm talking about, Taker. How do you like them apples? How? How? Yeah, I'm stronger than you. Stronger than you. Oh, takeover is it enough? No, they're all breaks. Son of a bitch. Oh, here we go again. This one's gonna get him. This one's gonna get him. Yeah, pin him. What are you doing, ref? One, two. Oh, you referee, you screwed me. You screwed me so bad right there. And a reverse by Undertaker. And somehow releases his finisher out of nowhere. Could someone explain that to me? It makes no sense. Looks like we're losing this match, and I'm gonna have to do it all over again. Son of a bitch. Roll break? Roll break. break. My foot's on the rope. Yeah, get out of here. Bull crap. Come on. Oh, the takeover. Come on. I need a reversal. Ah. Run away. There we go. Fez press. Oh, fuck you. Fuck you. You stay away. To the top rope. Didn't mean to do that. Flying nothing. There we go. Take him down. What? No! <laughs> How? How, dude? How? Dally Whacker! Oh my god! 10 seconds! Hit it! Pin him! What? What? <laughs> he reversed my fin attempt. Are you kidding me? Fuck this game.
How do you like them apples, Taker? Beat you this time. You punk ass busta. You want another one for good measure? Alright. See you later. I'm the champion now. And here's your winner and the new WWE Undisputed Champion of the World, Samuel Mr. Old School Wrestling. Undertaker fought hard, but uh, it wasn't enough to beat the young and up-and-comer. Give me my title. I want it. I really wish that that first match I would have won. But I got screwed over by Undertaker being impossible to hit a move on. He reversed my pin. Like, come on, how do you reverse a pin? Doesn't even make sense. <laughs> and there he is, the new WWE Undisputed Champion, Mr. Old School Samuel Rasslin. Oh shit, it's Charlie Hawes. Sub dog. It's a creepy little smile you got. You gonna challenge me for the title now? Money in the bank? <laughs> Ugh. Hey, help me up. You're my best friend. I love you. <laughs> there he is. The new face of the WWE. As he celebrates on the biggest stage of them all. On the grandest stage of them all, I guess. Alright guys, so that is this Let's Play. I hope you enjoyed it of Day of Reckoning uh, 1. Up next, we got Day of Reckoning 2, so I gotta make a new character, and uh, that will probably be uploaded on Tuesday, would be my guess. Still gotta create everybody, I haven't really started on that yet. So yeah, if you guys enjoyed this Let's Play, let me know in the comment section below, and uh, don't forget to leave a like, and I will catch you on Tuesday with more wrestling. Or I should say wrestling. wrestling has gone, he retired, he's done now. So... Till next time, guys. Thanks for watching, guys. If you want to see more of yours truly, be sure to click on one or all of the videos on your screen right now. Also, I have a Patreon account now, so if you feel like making a donation to help a struggling YouTuber out, that would be awesome. If not, I still love you, I think. Have a great day. Peace out, guys. And though the heart will turn into ash, the love that it has never will pass. And though the world's on fire eternal, the winds are changing.